In this video we'll briefly discuss the drug, paracetamol, how it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, and contraindications and precautions. First you should know that paracetamol is also known as acetaminophen. Paracetamol is an analgesic and antipyretic. It inhibits prostaglandins in CNS, but lacks anti-inflammatory effects in periphery, so it reduces fever, through direct action on hypothalamic heat regulating center. Paracetamol is known commercially as Panadol. And there are many other trade names, so use the drug index of your country to know all of them. It is available as tablets in concentrations of 500 and 1000 mg and also available as syrup and drops for infants and children. You may find it combined with caffeine, that strengths the effect of paracetamol. You may find it combined with an antihistamine and a decongestant, and this can be used for cold and flu. But this combination may cause sedation. So a combination with only a decongestant is made, to be used during the day, without the sedating effect of the antihistamine. And there are other combination of paracetamol with cough sedatives, and others for sinus relief. So paracetamol can be used for mild pain and fever, even if it's used alone or in combination. The dose for a child is 60 mg per kilograms per day, in 3 or 4 divided doses. And for adults, the dose is 3 to 4 grams per day, in 3 or 4 divided doses. Paracetamol should be administered with caution to patients with hepatic impairment. Indicated doses shouldn't be exceeded, especially in children and elderly patients, as this may increase risk of hepatotoxicity. It's very important to know that there is no contraindication with pregnancy or breastfeeding. Paracetamol is particularly recommended for patients allergic to aspirin, patients with a history of gastric problems and for pregnant and breastfeeding women and children. That's all for this video. Subscribe to get more drug information.